Well, hello, good morning, welcome. You're watching Headset VR. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to another gaming video. And today I'm trying another underappreciated horror game to see what this is like in VR. This is Moons of Madness. Now I'm playing here today in UEVR because it's obviously not a VR title, but we're pushing it into VR. Now I'm using the Quest 3 headset with the official Oculus Link cable and I have an RX 6600 XT GPU, a Ryzen 9 3900X CPU and I've got 32 gigabytes of RAM. Now I'm playing as well with the Quest controllers. So anyway, I don't know anything about this game apart from maybe it's a bit of a space-faring Lovecraftian horror. I love a good Lovecraftian horror. Out of body experience. Ah. The fuck was that? Okay. Hello? Anyone there? Right, now I know there are some mundane bits in this game where you go around and doing space station bits for chores. What happened here? I don't know, mate. Somebody's drawn two perfectly symmetrical circles on the uh, on the whiteboard there. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Toggle flashlight. Oh. That's handy. Anyway. Oh, 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 oh. Bloody hell. Do, do you mind, mate? I might have epilepsy for all you know. Somebody's fucked around with it. Electrics in here. What the actual tentacles is that? Oh! Whoa! An excuse to run? Come on! Come, blow out the candle. Oh, it's me birthday! Is it? No, it's not. Well, I'm going to be a good boy. I'll do what I say. I'll do what someone tells me to do. What? No, I'm not. Let's, uh... Spill my bowels. But that may have been our biggest quake yet. Standard procedure. New heart. You know what to do. If there's any critical damage to the base, let me know. Yeah. Okay. Uh, no problem. Dr. Van Buren, you will assist me at the landing site for the Cyrano. Declan, you're on comms. Find any system issues, relay them to Shane. Hey, hey, Captain. Switch to a private frequency, Declan. No chatter on open channels. Over and out. <sighs> private channel time. Okay. Right, now I'm told for the next bit of the game there's quite a few mundane bits where we're just going to get out about and do base jobs and that kind of thing. So, let's just uh, see what we've got and, well, we'll probably edit some, edit some of it out. But that was a pretty damn creepy start, if I must say so myself. You just hang tight while I do your job for you, okay? No, I have a coffee. No, really, take, take a load off. Well, let me just disable your object hook and just appreciate some of the scenery. Well, one of them's the sun, I know the one's moon or the moon or the earth. Right, so not sitting out in the space suit and we're space walking. It looks quite pretty out here, doesn't it? Might be if, if I'd have realised, I could have brought me a bikini or something. Aha. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
Lovely. Some fresh faces, supplies, distractions. Everyone's so on edge lately. I don't know, maybe I'm just imagining it. These dreams are starting to get to me. Yeah, you're not the only one having strange dreams there, Ace. You too? Oh yeah. I mean, put yourself in my shoes. You log out after your shift, eat some rehydrated meatloaf, and bunk down for the night. But the second you fall asleep, it feels like you're back at your desk and you hear the static again. Calibrate, more static, calibrate, then something sounds different, it's a pattern, you start decoding it, it's gibberish, but the static keeps talking. It wants you to hear the symbols. Don't worry about the big guy, they're just dreams. Yeah, and uh, then I wake up and there's scribbled notes around me. Feels like I haven't slept at all. All right, I showed you mine, now lay it on me. Dreams, nightmares, fantasies, your deepest, darkest fears. Let's hear it. Sorry, I just pulled up to the office. I'll have to get back to you on all that. Eh, suit yourself. The anticipation is killing me. Like a dead Martian eagle, thank you. Uh -uh. Uh, who's that? Who's what? Uh, don't know. Thought I saw someone. Okay, well, well that's got that sorted. Oh dear. What we gotta do next? We gotta turn off the water now. Okay, so the it's uh, so one thing about this, it does seem like a decent game, but there is quite a few mundane tasks at the start which just kinda get be a bit of a, a drag really, but I mean hopefully it does improve ooh. Get a little bit more horrorish at some point. But you know, one can only. What the Whoa. hell? Declan, are you there? What Declan. the fuck? God damn it, Declan! Ooh! Uh, what is that? What the fuck? Ooh! Fucking hell. Oh! Oh! Shit. Uh, go, 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 go. Uh. Where am I gonna run? I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> Down, maybe? <clears throat> Whoa, okay. There's a horrible creature in the greenhouse. It tried to kill me. Do not return to base. Does anyone read me? Ina, Lucas, Commander Wilcox. I've got to warn them. What the fuck? Oh, well, that thing's just 
Give me the proper willies! Right, so I'm just going to see if I can get to the communication site. And I think we're going to end the video just then. I've played through quite a bit of this just to get through some of the, the mundane part of it. Doing all the chores and everything like that. And, uh, well, it's just kind of exploded into life here. Oh, anyway, this is the... Uh, we're going to go out onto the surface, I believe, now. So, yeah, let's uh, get the fucking hell out of here. Now, just to, um, as my little final wrap-up, I mean, this plays pretty damn good in UEVR, apart from a couple of little things. Now, I've not really had much of a, a mess about with the profile that I've sort of made inadvertently. But as you can see, when in the, in the space helmet, it's sort of a bit like that. Now, I've not really had a bit of a fiddle to, like, level that out or anything. I'm sure if I messed about with it, I can do, but I'm not going to do that now. We just want to put out as many scary games, unappreciated horror games, games that you don't know about, games that you do know about, games that will freak you out. And we want to put them on the channel so you guys can appreciate them. Maybe get a taste of what they'll look like in VR. And I promise you they are a lot scarier in VR than they are in flat screen. Anyway, so let's just pop into here. Well, this is a uh, good fun drive in this. Right, so I think we're going to end the video just here. Now we've had that little run-in with that uh, tentacle nasty. I think we're going to save up and uh, do more a little bit another time. I think I'm definitely going to do some more of this after the Halloween period has finished. But for now, I would like to say thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Like I say, there is quite a bit of uh, mundane content in here where you go around doing chores. But as I've said, I'm going to edit all of that out. So you'll probably find that there's not two and a half hours worth of gameplay here. It's just what you see. So I'm just going to say thanks very much for watching. You've been watching Headset VR play Moons of Madness using the UE VR mod. It plays great in native stereo. I'm using the nightly build of UEVR, and um, it's quite creepy in a couple of places. And as you saw, that lovely little uh, chase scene. So, um, yeah, I'd give this a shot. It's quite cheap. And like I say, it's only a short game. It'll probably take about five or six hours to complete the whole thing. So, anyway, we're just going to end the video just here. Check out the game. Like the video if you like what you've seen. Give us a sub if you want to see more VR related content, specifically scary stuff over the Halloween content. And also give me a message if you can afford to help me pay for a new roof on this Land Rover. Anyway, if you've got any comments you want to make about the video, chuck them in the usual place. I'll respond to every single comment as and when I'm able. But other than that, I'm just going to say thanks very much. This is Headset VR's Halloween Horror Show. You're watching Moons of Madness in UE VR. What the fuck? Declan? There's something wrong. There's definitely something wrong. Anyway, if you want to Where see everything go? what's out here, mm -hmm. then maybe watch the next time. Thanks for watching. We'll see you soon. Or won't we? <laughs>